Hey guys, um, happy Friday night. I am coming on to uh, give you a look at everything I got in my January Central Rewards order. I was very excited. It's supposed to come yesterday, so it's a little bit late, but in addition to getting this today, um, I also got an amazing resource that I'm going to share. Um, so I'm going to start with my stuff that I paid for first and then move into my free stuff like I usually do. So the I was really excited for this first thing I'm going to show you. Um, it was what I was most looking forward to until the White Angelica was um, back in stock and re-released. So this is kind of tied with that. Um, and the White Angelica smells so amazing. Um, a couple of my friends who got it, got it before me. And so I smelled it on them and I just couldn't wait to get it open. Uh, so I guess I'll start with that. Um, it was a limit of, you couldn't get any more than two on your account um, per like member um, because of its availability. So I got both, both that I, that I was allowed. Um, so two of them. Um, I opened one, I got, and I noticed that when I put it on, it's like a little thick. So if you use oils, um, it has like a higher viscosity than um, most of them. Vetiver is one that has a really high viscosity um, and smells really, really good. So um, I was very excited to get that. I don't even really know that much about it yet. So I'll get back to you on that. So what I was most excited for before that was um, I got a frankincense resin burner. I'm not used to using this laptop one, so it's taking me a second to get used to how to hold all these things. Um, frankincense resin burner. Um, the reason, I, I think I had my eye on this a while back. I can't really remember. And then, of course, I forgot about it because I get excited about getting so many different things. Um, but I was at my friend's house uh, last month and walked in. And I know she, you know, she has oils and stuff and she diffuses and... I didn't know, like I could tell I smelled frankincense, but I couldn't tell why it smelled so different. So I was like, your, frank smells, your frankincense smells amazing, like what are you doing? Um, so she says, oh, I got this resin burner. So I'm like, okay, show me this. And it smells so amazing when it's burning in here. So, very pretty. When I first saw hers, I, I kind of thought it reminded me of a chalice, but it's like a copper. It's really, really pretty. Um, and then you, of course, I didn't play with this first, but it looks like it's stuck. And I don't want to break it. But anyway, there is a little dish inside here. I can figure out how to get it off. There's a dish inside of here. I can't get it up right now. I'll have to figure that out. Um, and it plugs in. And there's like one of those little switches on the front. And then you put just plain old actual frankincense resin on it. Um, and then it will heat up. You don't put anything else in it. No, you know, you don't add anything. You just put this in there. And then it will um, kind of like melt down a little bit and then there's like this little thing that you can scrape off the resin with if once it gets too burnt and take it out um but it totally totally smells amazing so anybody who likes this scent this is highly recommended because um frankincense is good for just and so many things you can look it up i always say look it up so i can stay compliant um but it's really really amazing so as soon as i'm done this video i'm plugging this in and starting it because it just smells really amazing. And then when you, when like when I need more, like this is the bag that comes with it. But when I need more, there's a huge bag. It's probably like maybe a little bit taller than this one, but it's fatter. Like it's really full of stuff. So um, there, I'm looking forward to that. The next thing I want to go with is, I guess, I love talking about this. So I'm going to go with this. Um, orange Blossom Face Wash used to this camera orange blossom face wash it's amazing um it's very gentle it cleanses really nice it's good for my more mature skin it's good for my kids 
no matter how your skin is, it's really, really nice um, face wash. So um, funny thing about this is when I first joined um, Young Living over a year ago, one of the things I was looking to buy after I was um, trying out some oils and I then wanted to move into trying some other products, I wanted to try this, but I was like looking at all the sizes and the prices and said it was $44. Well, this is, um, or, or 42, something like that. This is only four ounces. And I'm like, not a chance. I'm paying 44 or 42, whatever it was, dollars for four ounces of face wash. I'll go through that in a week. Um, but I'm in a lot of really cool educational groups. So I learn a lot of things about um, how to use everything, you know, what people are using for what, and, you know, just all different ways. Because you could ask a group of 100 people the same question, like, what do you use this for? Um, you're going to get 100 different answers. So it's really nice to have those people as a resource. Um, so about the orange blossom face wash. One of the things I learned in the group was you don't, oh, nobody pours that out of the bottle. Like it's a little, you know, a little squeeze top. Nobody squeezes that out and washes their face with that. That would be a waste. So I was, um, it was recommended that I get foaming soap pumps. They're just a little four ounce BPA, BPA free plastics foaming soap pumps. So I'm like, okay, never did it before. So all I had to do was like squeeze a tiny bit into this, fill the very bottom of it, and then fill the rest with distilled water. And then you can add like a little um, witch hazel to that because that helps to preserve, like it's like a, it has a natural um, preservative in it. So um, you're like the water doesn't go, go funny. So anyway, I did that. I made one for my sink and I made one for my shower. And then that lasted me um, six months. After I did my sip and sniff in July, um, I did a video, I think, on um, showing how much I had left in there from January. Uh, and then I made it again. Mm -hmm. Now I'm on that, probably that same amount in my bottles. I have this, the bottle on my shower, the bottle on my sink. There's probably like this much left in each bottle. So I'm using one, I'm using both of those at least once a day. And I'm still not out. Like I just got this because I know that when I make my next bottle, I'm going to need to replace it and I don't want to be without it. So I ordered it this month. So I'd have it. So yes, it was 42 or $44. That's enough. My cat's crying. Um, but it lasted me for the entire year. So that is like unbelievable. I mean, I don't really know what else I could say about that. Um, I don't know when the last time I bought any product that I use every single day, more than once a day, that lasted me a year. So this, if you don't have it and you're looking for a new face wash, this is it. So that's that, that orange blossom face wash. Next thing I'm going to go with is um, eucalyptus. I love eucalyptus. I have a lot of it. Um, not, I don't have all of it. Um, there's three different kinds of eucalyptus. This is globulus. Um, I ordered this for a friend. Um, so I'll be giving that to her. Um, I love eucalyptus. I use it all the time for sinus support. Um, I guess next I'll go with bergamot. Bergamot is one of those oils I tried when I first tried it just because I wanted to try everything and I didn't really know what was what. Had no idea that this was a citrus fruit, bergamot. Never heard of it before I started using oils. Um, and it smells absolutely amazing. It's very dark. Um, I don't want to open it because I have one open already. Um, but it's almost out, so that's why I reordered it. But it smells very strong smell, but a very good strong smell. Um, and I use it just straight out of the bottle. I just kind of like go like this with it. And I put it on my neck, back of my neck, per like my wrists. I wear it for perfume. It smells Absolutely amazing. Every time I do wear this for my perfume, I'm always stopped. I mean, at least twice or three times. Um, or if I'm talking to somebody, they're like, what are you wearing? Because I'm a big mover of my hands when I talk. So the scent, I guess, starts flying around. Um, and so it's usually this gets the most questions is the bergamot because it just smells so amazing. Um, it's really uplifting. It pairs really well with, I got black pepper last month and I couldn't figure out what I wanted to diffuse with that. 
and I just looked it up and it was bergamot with black pepper and it just was unbelievable. It was so nice. Um, it doesn't smell like you think black pepper. You just think that's weird. You put pepper on your food, whatever. It's good. It's really, really nice. And because bergamot is an uplift, um, uplifting um, aroma, the black pepper, that's also very uplifting. Um, it was very nice, very nice to get, you know, get you go and keep you energized. Um, the next one I'm going to go with is um, the Stress Away Roller. I make a lot of rollers for many, many different reasons. But um, there is about, I think, five altogether from, from directly from Young Living that they bottle. Um, and that is this one, the Stress Away. There's Tranquil, which is really, really nice for sleep. Um, there is Rudavala, which is not available for purchase. Um, I got my Rudavala roller um, as a promo back in the spring, I think, or maybe early summer. Um, it wasn't available for sale, but they were giving it as a free promo um, if you're on Central Rewards. So that's how I got mine. I don't love the smell of it. It's very intoxicating, um, but it's it does it does its job. So I do like the effect that it has um, for what I'm using it for. Now, the Stress Away, I have Stress Away. Stress Away comes in the starter kit, so that was my first experience with it. And I I have repurchased it. Can I talk tonight? I rebought it <laughs> twice since the starter kit because I use it so much, and it's really nice in um, a lot of the rollers that I make. But I did have someone order Stress Away Roller and I thought it smelled a little bit different in the roller than it does in the bottle, which I'm sure it doesn't, but I don't know. I can't explain it. Um, but it's lime um, and vanilla. It's very, very nice and very relaxing. Um, what else is in here? Lime and cedar wood and lavender. So very nice, um, relaxing oils. Um, and this is another one you could totally wear for perfume um, because it just smells so pretty. And I don't wear perfume anymore. So anything that I can um, whip up or just get naturally that smells like perfume, that's what I do because um, I don't like to, I'm totally against now for my own personal use. I mean, no judgment. Everybody does what they want. Um, but I don't use anything with fragrance and I don't allow my kids to. So um moving on i'm going to go with highest potential this is a brand new one and um, for me I, i've never um ordered this i have to get used to this um i've never ordered highest potential before today but so i'm going to open it and smell it but i totally have plans for myself this year and i i thought this would be nice to have to you know support me and doing those things because I have things that I am totally going to accomplish and this is going to help me out with I mean I'm a pretty confident person but I think this will help me out a little more that's real nice I have to say sometimes I open an oil and I'm like that stinks it's disgusting but I still use it for whatever I need it for but this is really really nice so you know it elevates the mind which is never a um you know who doesn't want that when they're trying to accomplish things. Um, it gives you confidence, like much like the Valor, emotional balance. So very excited for that one. My next one, and which is also a brand new one, is called Humility. I've never used this before or smelled it before. And of course, I'm very excited. Dry, sorry. So Humility. I'm really into learning about frequencies this year. Um, I spent a lot of last year learning about oils, essential oils in general. Um, so I said this year, these are some kind of things I wanted to learn about. Frequencies um, is one of those things and gut health is the other. Um, because you'd be amazed at what um, your gut pretty much has everything to do with your overall health. Um, so I plan to learn a lot about that. So humility is one of the oils that has a high frequency and our bodies have frequencies and certain things that we do 
and expose ourselves to during the day, every day, lower your frequency. And when your frequencies are low, you're more likely to um, be, I guess, you know, get sicker easier. Um, so I would like to, and I drink coffee a lot, which really lowers your frequency just by even smelling it, which is something I learned about a month or two ago. And I was like, oh, of all the things I'm going to stop, coffee is not one of them. Um, so because coffee lowers my frequency, I use a lot of oils. I try and use a lot of oils daily that will raise my frequency back up. Um, and actually I saw someone say that they put this on the dryer balls. I don't know. I like it, but I don't. Yeah, I guess, I think it was just the first smell that was not very good. It smells pretty good. I can't even... I can't put a finger on it, so I'm just gonna um, take a peek at the ingredient label. Which is under the peel here. Another nice thing about the bottles is um, it tells you, uh, the only time you really have to look at ingredients is when it's a blend, because when it's a single oil, it's only the oil. There's nothing else in here. That's why I chose this company. But I just wanna show you real quick, because I don't know. If I want to just be able to show you without a glare. I don't think I can. Anyway, it just tells you that it's there, you know, 100% pure therapeutic grade essential oil. But in here, there's always on every single bottle the ingredient label if it's a blend. I don't know if you can see that. Um, the ingredient label if it's a blend, and then directions for use. So, for instance, this one says. Topical, apply two to four drops directly to desired area. Dilution not required except for the most sensitive skin. Most things I don't dilute anyway um, because my skin can tolerate it. Um, except for the hottest oils like maybe cinnamon and, <clears throat> excuse me, even Panaway that says you're supposed to dilute it. I don't usually dilute it because I like the way it works without it. Um, so yeah, so I just wanted to give you an idea of how all the bottles work. The next one is Gentle Baby. I absolutely love I don't even know where I got kicked off, but um, Gentle Baby is where I was. Um, it's one of the oils I got shortly after um, I started experimenting outside the kit. Um, it's very, very nice for skin. There's a ton of good skin oils in here. This is another blend. Um, there is coriander, geranium, palmarosa, lavender, lang lang, roman chamomile, bergamot, jasmine, and rose. So all of those oils individually are excellent for your skin. Um, so put them all together, and what do you get? Gentle baby. Also, it's really good for babies. Um, it's good for pregnancy. Um, so during your pregnancy, after birth, it's good for like chapped skin. Diaper rash is awful for your baby. Um, so you can, um, diaper rash cream, I'm sorry, diaper rash creams, I'm not gonna name names um, because they're all pretty not, you know, good. Um, you can totally make um, spray, uh, a recipe, from this, very, very, you know, much better for your baby's skin. Um, so, what else, what else? I think I tried this on my dryer balls once too, maybe on my comforter, and it was it was nice. Next thing, <clears throat> I'm sorry, I don't know why I'm so dry. Another new thing to me, I tried a lot of new stuff this, um, let's say this year. Um, I tried a lot of new stuff this month, um, and so for the first time I'm getting, I got um, a massage oil. Um, of course, everything that I have here, I'm out, I don't know if you can see, my oil shelf is behind me. It's pretty full of things. Um, I could use all of any of that in massage, um, but you, it, there's a matter of mixing and there's a matter of doing things that if you're in a pinch, um, you know, for time or whatever, you don't want to have to mix everything up yourself already pre-made so this is in a carrier oil and it has other oils in it which are winter green which is really really good for muscle and joint health 
uh, wintergreen peppermint, juniper, eucalyptus, <clears throat> marjoram, thyme, vetiver, uh, a couple other um, carriers. And it comes like this sealed. But there's a pump here. You just add it in if you've ever bought um, fractionated coconut oil. You can add your pump afterwards, so it's for shipping purposes. <clears throat> Excuse me. So that was well, not all my. I was gonna say that was all my paid stuff. It was not all my paid stuff. I got two other things. I got some pamphlets for um, incorporating oils with um, your yoga practice, and also incorporating oil, oils with um chiropractic visits um so i wanted to learn a little bit more about that so i got some pamphlets for that now before i do my promos and show you everything i got for free i'm going to show you my awesome research um my awesome resource i'm totally <coughs> excuse me i'm always researching oils uses for oils how to incorporate them in pretty much everything i do so this was released not too long ago. It's a book by Sarah Harnish, who is um, very high up in Young Living. And she wrote an amazing book um, called The Game Plan that I um, use and um, work from. And there, she made this book, and it's amazing. It's called Fearless, Confidence with Essential Oils in Two Hours. So pretty much just saying that <clears throat> I would take you about two hours to get through this book. And by the time you're done, you'll know exactly what you need to do with many, many things, but especially the starter kit. Because the oils that come in that kit are so versatile and so popular and can do so many things um, that that is why that's where most people start. Um, aside from the fact that it has all the amazing oils, it has a diffuser in it. And diffusing rather than burning candles is fabulous. So I'm very excited to have this book because, <coughs> excuse me, there's ideas, challenges, ways to use the oils, and then ways you can keep learning. Um, so that's that. Oh, and it's very cheap on Amazon. I got it for $4.50. So if you have like Prime, you just throw it in with something else again or whatever. So now I'm going to move into the stuff that I got for free. <clears throat> um, I'm on essential rewards. If you pay any attention, you know that. Um, and that's a program where I um, earn free things and points for stuff that I'm going to buy anyway. So pretty much they um, reward me for buying things that I was going to buy because I wanted them anyway. So a lot of what I get in um, my promos, some of it is stuff I've never used before. And other stuff is stuff that I maybe wanted to try, but hadn't, like I didn't get around to buying it yet. And then I get it for free. So that's real exciting. So the, <coughs> there are different um, tiers. So when you are on essential rewards, your first um, reward starts at um, 100 PV and PV equals dollar amount. So the first, because I had the first um, one for 100 PV, I got spearmint. Uh, spearmint I use for, you know, you can use it for a lot of the same things you use peppermint for, but it's a little sweeter. I do like it in my water. When, <coughs> excuse me, when Lacey has bad breath, I put it in her water. Um, so the second thing is deep relief. Um, amazing for muscle, joint, support, head tension, neck tension, whatever. Um, it, you, it does not normally come like this. Like this is one of those things that is exclusive to a person on essential rewards. If you're not on essential rewards, and this is at the next tier at 190, if you're not on essential rewards, you cannot get this. Um, <clears throat> I had a deep relief roller, which is what I got a while back for Steve, but I don't 
it used to be his, but now it's mine because I keep it. And if he needs it, he asks for it. Um, and this is like just like the stress away roller, um, pre-made as a roller top. <coughs> I such a tickle. I'm so sorry, guys. Um, but it doesn't usually come in um, in a bottle like this. So you can always they make they make roller tops like these. Take me off again. I think that's my sign that I better wrap this up. Um, so anyway, deep relief, good for many, many things. Um, and I'm going to pop a roller top on, on top of that because I'm just used to using it that way. So at the, <clears throat> at the 250 one, I don't even know. I don't know which one it is, but Super Cow Plus is another one that um, was free this month. It's really um, good for bone health. And this was actually specifically um, specifically formulated for bone health. So because there's so much information to learn about this one, what I'm going to do is when I'm done the video, um, hey, Ariel, when I'm done the video, I'm going to um, post a link in the comments. <coughs> Ariel, I could really use one of those thieves um, cough drops that you got yesterday because I'm dying right now. Um, I have a tickle in my throat. The water's not helping me out. Um, anyway, um, I'm going to post a, a link in the comments when I'm finished so you guys can see all the stuff that is in this and what it does for your body and where the stuff is sourced from. It's amazing. I was reading up on it the other day when I knew my order was on its way, so I wanted to see because I love trying out the supplements. I usually get I usually get all the supplements for free. The next one is Panaway. Panaway is one that is really good for <clears throat> another good for muscle and joint um, tension and you know you had a stress that a stressful day. You come home, put a couple drops of this in the tub with some lavender maybe, copaiba, and you're set. You're good to go. Um, I love this one a lot. Uh, I think I said it was a starter kit oil. Um, so I actually bought this one other time after starter kit. And so now this is my third bottle. Next and the last one, this is the 300 PV promo Copaiba, which does not get enough attention. I feel like nobody really talks about this oil and it's just amazing. And fun fact is that Copaiba is actually part of the marijuana family. So um, it has some, I guess, I hate to use the word medicinal, but <clears throat> it's in that family. Um, it's and actually good, and a lot of people don't know this, it's actually really good for respiratory health. Um, and it's a magnifier. So if I am using my Panaway, for instance, for, <coughs> excuse me, for some kind of tension, and I pair it with this, it enhances the effect of what this is doing for me. And it's just totally amazing in that respect. I noticed that amazing and very excited are things I say a lot. Sorry if I'm annoying everyone. I tend to repeat myself. Um, but anyway, it's really, really good. And so there's a word that is very high in. Ariel can help me out. Uh, beta carophylline, I think it is. Anyway, it is, um, and beta carophylline, again, look it up. But it's something that um, it, it was, it's been like researched for its ability for your body to like um, modulate irritation. So um, there's a whole bunch of stuff you can read about that. Um, just Google everything. That's what I do. Um, so that's pretty much it. <clears throat> excuse me, that was 30 minutes. I mean, that was everything, all my stuff that I got, um, that I ordered for myself and all the stuff that I got for free that I'll be using, adding to my shelf over there. Um, and like I said, the most, the thing that I'm most excited for, and I'm gonna show you because uh, Ariel is the person whose house I was when I smelled the resin, the frankincense resin. 
So I'm very excited to do this. Please tell me, Ariel. One of the one of the sides seems to be stuck in here. Is it supposed to be like that? Um, because I can't get it out. And I know that you took yours straight off. So I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong, but it's I'm doing something wrong. I don't think I'm gonna be able to open it. Um so that's that. So that was the whole box. I'm sorry I coughed through that so many times. I'm sorry that we got disconnected twice. Um, but if you have any questions, obviously just ask me in the comments and I'm gonna post that thing. That's super cow floss. And maybe I'll post something about the Copaiba too so you can see that. But okay, yeah, mine is like that too. You wiggle it. Okay. So I will wiggle that out and maybe I'll post a picture or something once I have it all set up because I really want to smell that. So if you have any questions, just let me know.